what's I'm all welcome to my video today I am doing a week in my life vlog nursing school edition for those of you that don't know me my name is Emma I am a nursing student from Chamberlain University my prevalence is most notably known on Instagram under the handle Emma the future nurse um, so I'm creating another video. I have been getting so many questions to do a week in my life vlog after my last one hit off really well. So um, that's what we're doing this week. Today is Monday, March 15th. I am in my pediatric nursing rotation. I am also taking nutrition as well. So today is Monday, so I have my class at one o'clock. It's a one to four class. I am still virtual, so that means I have to show up on uh, WebEx or Zoom, if you will, and be present during the lecture. So it is currently 8.47 right now. I have a hair appointment at nine o'clock that I am going to, and I will be back by probably say 12.30-ish. Oh my. Currently driving to my hair appointment, obviously. Um, I try to do the most with my time because I am in nursing school. My time is extremely limited. just wanted to show you guys my hair so i got a curtain bang that is something new that i got i normally have like a few strands of hair in front of my face anyways but i just asked her to add a little bit more to it my appointment was at nine i was a little bit late because i got duncan and i ended up spilling it there so it was just a complete waste anyways but I had to go to Target to get my prescription medication. For those of you that don't know, I do suffer from depression, anxiety, and I recently got diagnosed with ADHD, the inattentive aspect of it. So I'm now on Ritalin due to statewide regulations um, because it is a controlled sub substance, Ritalin. I can only pick up my prescription on specific days. So I had to stop at Target because I do get my prescriptions from Target in the CVS pharmacy there. Um, so I picked that up. I had to get a couple miscellaneous things at Target and then I was a little bit late to my class but I was listening to lecture on my way home. So I have class until four o'clock and then I'm having one of my one of my close friends over and we're going to be studying for our pediatrics exam on Wednesday. Yeah, so that's what's going on today for Monday. Wednesday's my longer day. I have seven hours of lecture. On Wednesday, I have an 8 to 12 p.m. class, which is nutrition, and then 1 to 4 is my peds class. But, you know, sitting at your computer for seven hours sucks. So I typically try to, like, walk or do something in between class really quick. So that's what we're doing today. I just wanted to give you guys a brief little update because I did get home and I rushed to my computer. But now we're in a break. And it sounds like we're going back. Hi guys. Happy Tuesday. Today is March 16th. Um, it's about <clears throat> almost 8 o'clock. It's about a quarter to 8. I have a test tomorrow in peds, so I'm getting up a little bit early to study for it, to finish reviewing some stuff, and then I have to work today at 3. I work at the hospital. I work 3 to 11, so I'm currently in the process of cleaning and washing my scrubs so they're ready for work today. I have to leave around 2 o'clock, so that's why I kind of got up a little bit earlier. Normally, I get up, I would say, around 8.30. I also have to go get blood work for my psychiatrist because, I don't know, honestly, there's like a whole bunch of stuff on there to get like my 
thyroid levels checked, just a basic blood work panel. So I have to do that at 10.15. So basically my goal before I leave for work, I want to get done with my little um, study guide that I made for my first exam tomorrow. Take that to work, kind of review it at work. I don't have any class today. I try to work on Tuesdays. So that's what we're doing today. Like I said um, in this video already, Wednesdays are my big class day. So I tried to get majority of the stuff done before Wednesday, such as like any type of assignments that are due. lecture for my exam tomorrow i'm going over pain right now in the pediatric population i have to leave here soon to get my blood work done but that's what i'm doing right now oh hello i am on my way to my blood work appointment thankfully it is not too far away so i will be home in time to hopefully finish most of this study guide that I've been working on. I'm hoping this blood work doesn't take long. Like, they just gotta prick my arm and just take all the blood for me. So I got back around 11 o'clock for my blood work. Um, there was some issues, so I probably have to go back and get two other labs done, but that's fine. It's currently 12.41. I plan on starting to get ready around 1.30 for work. So I'm just going to like shower. I like to do just a little bit of makeup. Nothing like foundation wise on my face. I'm making some lunch right now. And I'm almost finished with my study guide. I think I have like a couple more things I want to add to it. But yeah, that's what I'm doing so far. I have all my laundry hung. Um, I'm done with laundry, everything's folded and put away, so I've been super productive today. Um, and there's my delicious lunch. Some veggies, and I just threw an egg in there for some protein. Try to eat healthier and, like, practice portion controls. And then over here, I did pack my lunch already. So last night, I ended up making some dinner. I did barbecue chicken. I have some mac and cheese in here, and then just some corn. So since I'm working like a split shift, I like to eat dinner and I kind of get to eat it around a normal time. Like I'll probably sit down around like seven o'clock to eat some dinner. Um, so I'll eat this beforehand and then when I'm on my way, I'll probably like eat a small snack while I'm driving to the hospital. Happy Wednesday, happy St. Patty's Day. So I just did my nutrition lecture. I tried to get up at six o'clock and it just did not work. So I got up at like uh, seven, seven fifteen. I don't work today, um, but I do have class until four o'clock. So I just placed a target.com order and I'm going to pick up this little outfit that I have planned because me and my best friend, we are going out tonight. And when I say going out, I don't mean like, oh, we're gonna go get super lit. No, that's not it. I have found that I have to have a healthy balance in my life. And when I just do work in school, work in school, it was wearing on me. And I was just noticing that I wasn't happy and that I was just getting more agitated. So I've been trying to see my friends and see my family a lot more instead of just being like a snail that lives in my apartment and just does school and just does work. So I'm super excited. This is our third week of going out on a Wednesday. That's what I'm doing. But today we're actually going to a winery, me and my best friend. I'm really excited. I have this really cute outfit idea that I'm planning on wearing. It's going to be like 
light wash jeans, a black sparkly top, and then I have like this pink blazer that I ordered off Target. I have to go get my TB test placed. Um, last week I did my step one of the TB. Now this is my step two, so I get it placed today, and then I have to get it read on Friday. And then after that, I'm getting my nails done. I know all of you guys were yelling at me in a couple videos about, oh, your school allows you to get your nails done. I'm completely online. My classes are online, my clinical is online, I'm fully online. So yeah, and my work doesn't care either. Plus, it makes me feel good about myself. So I have a super, super busy day. I wanted to get a discussion post done and just various things. So that's going to be my plan today, but I'm super excited. I've been looking forward to this day all week. My nutrition class ended a little bit early today because we only ended up going over one chapter um, for a four-hour class. Um, but we were supposed to have our exam today, but my teacher was kind enough to move our exam next week because a lot of us are in peds and she didn't want us to have two tests on the same day so we moved our nutrition exam to next week so it's currently 11 35 i'm just going to do the target drive up she's going to put it in my passenger seat then i'm going to get a duncan and then finish studying for this exam later which is going to be at one so i just got home from target my duncan i'm going to show you guys what i got I just posted on my Instagram story about these pens, but these are the Flexion um, erasable pens. They're amazing. I bought a couple from the personal planner site. I absolutely love them. So I just bought some of the colored ones and also the black ones. And then I was reading some reviews about this lotion, but I needed a good lotion still because I'm running out of my hemp stuff. So I got a lotion. So I saw this super cute jacket. Look how cute. This is something I would never wear because I'm just not like a pink person. But I'm super, I'm super, I'm super excited. And it was on sale too. Oh, this is going to fit pretty nice. Like I have a hoodie on, so it's a little tight in the arms. But like with a cute tank top or something. It's currently noon right now. I am going to finish doing my last minute review before the test and then we're going to take our exam. I typically finish the test super quick so I'll probably shower in between that break because she'll give us like an hour, hour and some change to get the test done. But in the meantime, I'll be getting ready and yeah, I love the Target drive up. I've not done it before and I will do it again, 100%. All right, are you guys ready to see this outfit? So this is what we're working with. I love this jacket. I think it's super cute. And then I just have this black sparkly top on underneath. So I just got my nails done. I sound like such a basic girl, but I'm really not that basic, I promise. Seldom do I get to go out and do cool things like this. So we are having all the fun today. I got my TV test and then I went and got my nails done. It's currently 5.50 and I'm on my way to my friend's house. Um, like I had mentioned earlier, we're going to this like winery. I'm super excited. Yeah, it's super nice out. It's like 60 degrees in the middle of March. I'm surprised. Yeah, that's the update. I did this purple color, this like pinky purple color and I really like it.
it is currently 11 24. I'm in my online virtual peds clinical right now. She gave us some case studies to do today, an eye human one, and then there's another one, and then we have to go back and meet with her at one o'clock. So I have in-person clinical experience, and I know I don't wanna work with kids, so I chose the virtual clinical option. So that's what I'm doing right now. Um, it's raining outside. I have some like true crime on in the background. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an update. This is what lunch is looking like. I just did a stir fry with those veggies, pork, and a little bit of brown rice. I have to hop back onto my virtual clinical now, so that's what I'm gonna be doing. I just finished answering all these questions, which was kind of tedious, but it is what it is. So I'm on my way to work at the restaurant. It's currently almost four o'clock, but I just wanted to kind of tell you guys what I'm feeling. Uh, you guys have seen the video. You guys saw that I did uh, go out last night. I got together with my best friend. Um, we did like a wine flight and then um, we got a bottle of wine afterwards. But because I'm on antidepressants, more specifically, I'm on Lexapro. There is like this downer period, this like down stage after you're drinking. For those of you that may not know, I did a sober period for a while. I was sober for six months and just I needed like a reset. Plus I wanted to be more consistent about taking my medications and that kind of thing. And I felt great, 100%. And you know, I enjoy going out. I enjoy having a glass of wine every so often, but I'm used to being up here all the time. And then today I just feel like down here. So I'm kind of like in the dumps today, just like feeling kind of down. Yeah, I did my hair this different way. Uh, since I got it cut, I have these like longer pieces here. Um, and I just pinned them back with like a bobby pin, sparkly bobby pin, and I'm gonna wear my mask. So that's kind of my look today. I didn't really want to do a lot of makeup too. Like that's the funny thing is, is like also makeup is literally my therapy. So now I don't wear a lot of makeup so often because I'm working at the hospital and you know, we're in a freaking pandemic now and it's kind of hard to do it. So I just felt blah today. I am getting a huge package of Glossier makeup. I'm going to try out. I think I'm gonna do a video about it because I got a lot of stuff. Comment down below if you guys would like to see like a full face of Glossier try on. I'm currently in the Duncan drive-thru getting some coffee before work. It's Friday! So I have so much stuff to do today. <laughs> I do this to myself, honestly. I mean, I'm so busy the rest of the week that whenever I have like a spare time, I tried to just like do everything and we're gonna see if it works today. I am currently about to leave to head to my dad's house. I haven't lived with him in quite some time. And I, when I moved out, I left some stuff there. Um, and he just put it in storage. So he got rid of the storage unit. So now all my stuff is just at his house. So I have to go through, organize, kind of find what I wanna keep. And I'm trying to find a pair of matching socks. I decided that I want a vanity. I have always had a vanity at my parents' place when I live with them. I'm going to kind of look around to see if I can find something. So this is the space I'm working with here. You guys can't really see. Right here. It has to be, like, it can't be 40 inches in length. So I'm trying to find something that has storage and that is also less than 35 inches if i could find a pair of socks like this would be great so that's my plan today i also work at 5 30. it's currently 9 30 so i'm up now we're like starting her early i stopped at duncan not my usual duncan because i was in the line for that duncan and it was taking too long and my patience is thin and also my new thing has been their avocado toast which is amazing big stretch 
Gia is so lazy. She won't get up to say hi to me. But the big boy will. The big boy will, because he's so good. Yeah. You want to go potty? You know. Okay, let's go potty. Okay, I'm opening the door. There they go. There they go. <laughs> so I just went and organized all of my stuff out in the garage. I ended up putting one box in my car and that basically had all of my Twilight books, um, bookmarked pages of my favorite quotes uh, when I read in high school. So I found my desk at Target. She's in the back. I got some organizers and I'm super excited because I have this vision. It's coming together. It's a little bit bigger than what I anticipated it being. So I have to go to Ulta now because I'm going to get like an acrylic makeup organizer that's going to sit on top of the vanity that's going to store like all of my everyday stuff. Normally like today I would just be spending all day doing homework but this is what happens. When I have an idea I stick to it and I can't let go of it and I had this idea for like a couple days now and here I am following through with it. I'm super excited to finally have like a designated space where I can sit down, unwind, and do my makeup. So you guys are going to see me put all of this together and hopefully it will be ready by the time I leave for work today. You guys, it is finished and she is so beautiful. So I set everything up. This is what it looks like. I'm absolutely obsessed with it so obsessed I got this mirror um for my birthday my boyfriend bought it for me and I have my makeup brushes over here I got those at Target these two containers were at Ulta and then I ended up putting this lining in here and I have like everything kind of miscellaneously <laughs> organized a little bit I've got to figure out how I want to organize things but this is pretty much all of my makeup like everything fit in here so well i'm super surprised and then this is everything that i got today so i'm gonna try out some stuff i swear i always buy these and then i end up finding them so i don't know what's up with that it's currently 2 15. oh i forgot also i got my pureology shampoo and conditioner i get the hydrate one and then i wanted to try out this truly stuff because i've heard really good things about it this is the truly buns of glory glory um, it's supposed to tone up your butt a little bit and asia your boobies. So I wanted to try these. The packaging is super nice. And then I got myself another wet brush. I'm super excited to get ready today. And I have a package that just got to my dad's. This always happens. So I'm going to eat, get ready, and then pick up my package, go to my TB test, and then go to work. Super productive today. Spent a lot of money today. But this is my Friday. I'm going to pick up my packages and I'm going to work. I rescheduled my TB because I can get it done tomorrow morning and that's just more feasible. I am going to end the video here. If you guys like these week in my life of a nursing student video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below that you like it. Also, thank you for watching until the end. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Emma the Future Nurse. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.